Last year, Bishop Lures hit the postseason and didn't look back. After a 4-5 and five regular season, the Knights winning six straight on their way to a state championship. While Lures may have surprised some people last fall, another championship would surprise no one. The Knights hoping to pave the road to Indy with a win against Eastern tonight. Pick it up early, James Kanapke hitting Nick Chapel. And uh, Chapel all alone in the end zone right there. 14 zip, Lures at that point. And after a Lures pick on the five-yard line, next play... D'Angelo Fincher, and uh, D'Angelo, he's fast, but that's actually fast forward. He's kind of one of those unsung heroes for this Lures team. A senior, doesn't get all that much love, but got a big touchdown right there. 95 yards, 35 zip Lures. Kanapke back to Chapel. Why not do it again? 42-0 Lures at that point, and as you might expect, the Knights rolling tonight, 63-14. to So the Knights... Advancing to face Manchester, the Squires topping Winchester tonight, 47 to 20. Other half of the sectional 27 bracket, Bluffton big over Wabash, 52-35, and Madison Grant shuts out Oak Hill as the Argyles are moving on. In the other 2A sectional, Central Oval at Memorial Field, you face Garrett and the train on offense in this one. Brayton Moreau hits. Brandon Porter, he's going to pick up 20 yards right there. Ron Fricky says, yeah, keep doing some of that. So, Braden Moreau, he, he didn't listen, though. He kept the ball. Mm. Scores a touchdown nonetheless. The train, we're not going to be denied at home tonight. Jamarius Mitchell punches that in as the train rolls on big time in this one. 42-14, the final. And they will face Eastside, the Blazers, sneaking by Prairie Heights, 18 to 12 in the other half of that bracket. Whitco season comes to an end. 2017, that game in overtime. The Wildcats' year ends at 8 and 2 in Fairfield, all over Woodland, 45 to zip. Tough loss for Wayne Swender's team in 1A. 13th ranked Adam Central at number 5, Churubusco. Jets upset Busco in the first round last year, but that was at Adam Central, and this was in Turtle Town. 0.7 seconds on the clock before the half. Dalton Combs, you heard the buzzer go off. He would find a receiver, Nathan Bussey, 28 6 Busco. Kyle Monk hands it off to Kyle Matthewson. Matthewson would break the single season school record for touchdowns, single season school record for yards in a season, career record for touchdowns, career record for rushing yards. Big night. But he doesn't have in great a hair. Shell. <laughs> you know, he doesn't have great hair, but Kyle Monk does. Sunshine goes 91 yards on this punt return. Again, he's fast. And Busco, oh yeah, they got some revenge. 50 to 6, a win for the Eagles. When I was a middle schooler, I remember watching that, you know, Drew Bianski break those or set those records. And I, I always wanted to prove everybody wrong. You know, I wanted to break those records, and I did it, I did it tonight. So Busco moving on. Who are they going to face? Well, it's going to be Southwood. Southwood upsetting Southern Wells. The Raiders falling to the Knights 24-14. Other half the bracket. Northfield keeps Fremont winless for the year 56-20. South Adams win their fit, wins their fifth straight, beating North Miami 21-14. Well, we are getting closer to the grand prize winner. Someone in the coming weeks will win a motorized scooter thanks to Parkview Trauma. And our weekly winner is Tanya Yokum or Jochim, depending on how you pronounce it. Yo I, knew, I knew a guy who actually pronounced it Yokum. So we're going to go with that. Tanya gets a prize package from Parkview. They also get entered in that grand prize giveaway. Go to the high school football page on Wayne.com to sign up. You know the drill by now. we got more Highlight Zone coming up next. Get right to Get it, right the Drive to Alive it. play of the week. For this one, we go down to the courtyard, and it's one. The more you look at it, the better of a catch it is. Kyle Marzek in the end zone. His mom must have enrolled him in Cantillion because you don't get this kind of footwork without <laughs> ballroom dance classes. Touchdown for the Lions, and they beat Norwell 31-7. to Let's look ahead to next week. 5A Northside traveling to Snyder. Southside at New Haven. Heritage at Leo. Manchester's at Lures and Cherubusco. At Southwood, if it's anything like this week, uh, you know, we should have some good stuff. It's going to be crazy. I can't believe I'm saying this, but the Comets actually with a West Coast game right now. First period over, Guy Dupuy with a power play goal. They're up one zip on the Arizona Sundogs. Thanks for watching. See you next week.